my name is Laura Milena Corredor Betancourt. This video is for the class of operations of Universidad de la Sabana. We are going to analyze waste. For this exercise, we are going to choose two fruits and we are going to use a blender, a recipient of 1.5 liters, a fruit strainer, a knife to peel the fruit and a scale. So first we are going to go to buy the fruit. The watermelon weighs uh, 2,474 grains. The pineapple weighs 1,200 grains. the same quantity we place the fruit with the water in this recipient because this recipient is 1.5 liters in this moment we pour in the pineapple with the water in this recipient so we are going to be doing the same with the watermelon afterwards we are going to put this in the blender and everything will have the same quantity going to measure the waste of the pineapple which is 681 now we are going to weigh the waste in the scale this is the waste of the watermelon which is 1120 grams In order to know how much is the waste for one liter, we did a rule of three in knowing that if for 681 grain of waste, it is for three liters, eh, the X will be 227 grains for one liter. We did the same with the watermelon, knowing that if for 1,120 grains of waste, it is for three liters, eh, we did the rule of three and the answer was 373 uh, grains for one liter so which means that the fruit with the most waste per liter is the watermelon so which one is the most rentable the most rentable in terms of waste is the juice of watermelon why because the cost of the pineapple is 2362 which is the percentage of a hundred percent of the cost the waste cost of 681 grams is 1340 that means 656 percent of the initial cost in the other hand, the cost of the watermelon is 7,376, which is 100% of the value. Then the waste cost of 1,120 grams is 3,339, that means 45% of the initial cost. We want to know how much money is it? So we understand that 2,474 grams cost 7,376 pesos. So we want to know how much is 373 grams. So we did a rule of three and that was equal to 1,112 pesos over liter. <laughs> 